Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020-2021 Panini Contenders Basketball. Six box, half case, pick your team at number 17. Now if you follow the instructions here, if you bought at least two teams or an even number of teams, half of those become entries for a shot at the Hornets. So let's take care of that first. We got that blank spot for the Hornets. Let's sort by column A by your first name. So Andrew bought two teams, that's an entry. Brian Heyman bought two teams, that's an entry. Carrie bought two teams, that's an entry. Kime bought two teams, that's an entry. Derek bought four teams, that's two entries. Jeff with two teams, an entry. James, two teams, one entry. John, two teams, one entry. Rick, two teams, one entry. Sean bought, oh, Sean got three teams, but for the purpose of the promo, two counts, still an entry. And Shane with two teams, an entry. So we got Shane, Sean, Rick, John, James, Jeffrey, Derek, Kaim, Kerry, Brian H., and Andrew. All right, so new dice, new list, name on top. After nine, name on top after nine gets the Hornets in the six box break. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. And it's James, there you go, James, after nine times. Congrats to you. You've got the Hornets in this break. <laughs> That's right, Sam. Uh, that'll help me sleep at night a little bit. All right, let's print and rip. Now, hopefully, this case will cooperate, well, not only with James, but with everybody. All right, now, let's pop open this fresh case right here, 2020, 2021 Contenders Hoops. See which six boxes we're gonna do here. All right. So there's six on the left side right here, six on the right side. Let's select a die. And we'll go one, two, three for the left six, four, five, six for the right six. Five. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this side we will save for we will save for the next break, which would be break uh, eighteen. So we'll mark those with eighteen so you know that they're from the same case. If you're watching live, we just posted that right now. So let's see what we got in here. Here's the final printout, hot off the presses. Thanks everybody for getting into the action. And it, it was Shane with the Knicks ended up with the official Last Bot Mojo. 70% of the time, Last Bot Mojo hits 100% of the time. Chad, uh, no, I don't know when Origins will be posted. Generally, a few days at least before the new for, before the release date. All right. Good luck, everybody. Thanks for the fill. With how many auto, two autographs? Yeah, two autographs per box on average.
Back-to-back -back NL Rookie of the Month awards for Frank Schwindel. Does that say something? Yes. <laughs> that says he, that he had a couple good months. I'm assuming you're talking about the NL Rookie of the Year award. Probably not. I don't think it's going to make a difference there. I feel like the the Vegas anyway has had has had Jonathan India has Jonathan India as like the the heavy favorite right there. So I think two months of work is pretty good, but that doesn't replace a season's worth of work. Zach Levine, 52 out of 249. Zach Levine for the Bulls. That's going to be for Matt Daniels. <laughs> if that's the way it worked, Rex, they, that, they, they would have said that's the way it works. The most rookies, rookies with the most rookies of the month would win the award, but unfortunately that's not how it works. There's Tyrese Halliburton for the Kings, John Ryder. And our first autograph is Karan Butler. 61 out of 199, legendary contenders auto for Jeff and the Wizards. Jeffrey. Nice Karan Butler. We'll do a quick little uh, recap at the end too. Steph Curry. We got a Hakeem Olajuwon, Legendary Contenders. That foil makes it look like it's like a low number, but it's not. It looks nice, though. It'll still ship. I think Vet Commons are the only things that won't ship. Yeah, no Vet Commons ship, but inserts and obviously the autographs will ship. So stuff like this will not be shipping. Right? This blank card won't ship either, but this will ship. 001 out of 149. Nice Rudy Gobert for the Jazz. Rick for the Jazz. There's Okongwu, lottery ticket. Obviously, that will ship, too. That's an insert. We'll ship some LeBron Jameses, too. Sadiq Bey. I don't know if these contenders base LeBrons are going to go for anything, but... Might as well. And there's our second autograph, Precious Achua, 18 out of 99 on card auto um, for Rick Serrano and the Heat. <laughs> did I? Well, I did he, John Peterson had a great first half. What was that? He. Cooled off considerably in the second half. All right, next box. This is four down territory. Let's go. Throw it, Derek. There it is. Renfro touchdown. Where was this in the first half? It's so weird. Going into halftime, did you guys hear the stat that the Raiders have the most second half points? You know. Has, has the most points scored in the second half. So random. Can't really put first halves together. I don't know. I mean, well, Raiders are still a work in progress. Is Obi Toppin lottery ticket insert? 
Oliver wondering if the Chargers are going to charge her. I don't know. There's playoff ticket. Davis Bertans to 249. Well, the Raiders definitely Raider in the first half, Oliver. So maybe the Chargers will charge her in the second half. Ooh, and I think a superstar die cut coming up. And it's Kawhi Leonard, superstar die cut. <laughs> yeah, at this point, Oliver, I want the over to hit because that means that means the Raiders have have made it a little bit made the scoreline a little more respectable. And we've got a Josh Richardson, legendary contenders autograph for the Warriors. That's 10 out of 10. Nice low numbered autograph for Sean Maddock who won the Warriors in that filler pack. Did I upload that pack break? I did, okay, just making sure. I think the total was 51 and a half. Jason Richardson, BD, thank you. Not Josh Richardson, Jason Richardson. Is Devin Booker. Could Devin Booker win an MVP someday? MVP contenders? Maybe. And there's Julius Randle, conference ticket. 29 out of 75 for the Knicks. Shane. Yeah, Brody, Hunter Renfro is a, is a big fan favorite for the Raiders. Really tough dude. And that works a good route, too. Ruled out? Oh, no. That's not good for the Raiders. And we got a Theo Maladon rookie ticket on card autograph for OKC. Andrew with the Thunder. Renfro, maybe uh, maybe dancing with the stars in the offseason. Hmm, I don't know if the Raiders are going to get stops against the Chargers, but turnover, I think, is what you got to be thinking of. If I'm, if I'm two defensive backs down, you got to sit there and be like, well, let's try to try to get some interceptions. I don't think Herbert does throw a lot of interceptions. Maybe some, maybe some fumbles. Maybe is what you're trying to hope for here. Like strip the ball from Eckler or something like that. Got a clipper, Daniel Toru. On card autograph for for Derek and the Clippers. Isolated. Water linebacker, you see here, Denzel Perriman doesn't get enough depth. That's a good play call by Bill McCarty. 
And we've got SGA, Shea Gilgis Alexander. Uh, 48 out of 149 for Oklahoma City. Obi Toppin, Rookie of the Year contender. <laughs> it's a competent defense now, actually. Ooh, and a redemption. Good luck, everybody. James Weissman, lottery ticket card. Insert going to Sean Maddock and the Warriors. Legendary contenders Larry Bird. There's Chris Paul, playoff ticket, 100 out of 249. They're going for it, huh? <laughs> Got it. Jared Cook revenge game. And there is a season ticket. Kawhi Leonard, that's in that contender's optic design. Kawhi going to Derek and the Clippers. All right. We got a rookie playoff ticket autograph. Good luck, everybody. Who do we have? J. Oh, Joe? Joe Jaspi? Josh? Josh Richardson? Josh Green. Uh, for Dallas, right? Why am I blanking on Josh Green? I think he's a maverick. Yeah, he's for Dallas. I know, right? It's for the Mavs. All right, we are halfway through this half case break. There's our there's our one of one kin. Maybe a little extra autumn fall mojo. Ooh, that's a sack. Raiders did get a stop. A little bit, a little life, Ramon, a little life. I like it. A little life for the Raiders. All right, we got a nice Zion superstar die cut for the Pels. That's going to be for Brian Heyman. Ooh, and I think this is either 
a short print. These license dominate. One per case, maybe, or is it even shorter printed than that? But it's LeBron. Carry with the Lakers. I wonder what this goes for. Someone feels like looking that up. There's a LeBron license to dominate. Insert, die cut. There's Trey Young, 48 out of 149. And there's a LaMelo Ball lottery ticket insert. That's for Charlotte. That's for James. Oh, so Abram, Corey, Oliver doing some research for us. So a couple hundred bucks, maybe up to 250 just, just for this alone. That'll cover the spot. Ooh, and a Patrick Williams autograph. Nice, 70 out of 99. Matt Daniels and the Chicago Bulls. <laughs> That's a good point, Corey. LeBron autographs are authentic to, uh, or are exclusive to Upper Deck, but this facsimile autograph might be the only LeBron auto you'd ever see out of a Panini product. That's a good point. And we've got an Alex Caruso, 34 out of 149. Lakers auto going to carry. Going to miss Alex Caruso. I think he's in Chicago with, uh, with Lonzo, I think. It's not a good, it's not. Ooh, going deep. Rugs? Catch, pass interference. Ooh. Wow. I mean, Rugs won't get the credit for those yards, but it's just as good as a reception. There's R.J. Barrett, 34 out of 49. And there's Giannis Antetokounmpo, superstar die cut. Sean Maddock and the Milwaukee Bucks. All right, two boxes to go. Second half of this is in the store, jazbeescasebreaks.com, if you want to snag your teams. Good luck. Sort of a dubious record if if you have a great comeback record, right? That means your team's been down a lot. <laughs> Derek Karstadt they were talking about a little bit earlier. It's a dubious honor, I want to say. score but maybe run a little clock maybe try to, try to give that defense a bit of a breather you want to have the Raiders defense get back out there maybe 
Here's Josh Jacobs. Ooh, Steph Curry. Wow, Steph Curry autograph. Nine out of ten MVP contenders auto. Sean Maddock. Well, first of all, the Warriors were last spot mojo. Nobody wanted them. Everyone's money was scared. But we ended up doing a filler for it. Sean Maddock won the Warriors in the filler and gets rewarded with a Steph Curry auto. Nine out of ten. Now Raiders touchdown. Let's do it. Two amazing things in a row. Now he throws it away. That's pretty sweet. A LeBron license to dominate and a Steph Curry autograph. And obviously those Steph Curry autographs are not too, not terribly common. Steve Nash, legend. All right, so Steph Curry autograph, pretty amazing. Raiders touchdown right here, amazing. Go. Throw it, Derek. Right now. Got him. Darren Waller, touchdown. Woo! 21 14, Raiders. Woo! Woo! -hoo -hoo. There's Blake Griffin to 75. Right, great job, Raiders offensive line. Gave them all sorts of time. And that's I'm, I'm actually more surprised about that. You expect TDs from Darren Waller. You don't you don't expect the Raiders offensive line to give him that kind of time. We got Dame, superstar die cut. Darren Waller's fired up. All right, well, Raiders defense, let's see what you can do. This would be a good time for like a key a key turnover for the Raiders defense. There's without a couple starting defensive backs, I think that's that's an that's an issue. So, I don't know. <laughs> do the Chargers not have fans, Gilo's asking. Well, yeah, it's pretty tough. I mean, the, the 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 snarky answer is nope, right? But if you really want to dig into it, I mean, they were in San Diego for so long, and they were, you know, San Diego's natural sports rivals with with Los Angeles. At least they think so. So you you weren't didn't have a lot of built-in fans in Los Angeles for the Chargers, and not a lot of San Diego fans had, uh, you know, they weren't gonna become LA Charger fans, you know what I mean? Not people in San Diego. So what you get is a small population of, of people in Orange County who, who is just south of us, who, uh, where, where Sean grew up. Um, so you have a small chunk of that population that ended up being Chargers fans a little bit further south, so, which is not a lot. All right, there's DeMar DeRozan, 111 out of 140. <laughs> yeah, Dave's saying Sean J. be a little quiet now. Well, I mean, the game's not over <laughs> yet. We'll, we'll wait until the end, but I'll take 14 on answer. I just, I mean, listen, I, did not ex I don't, didn't expect my Raiders to go 17-0 this season, right? But, hey, if they, I just want to see some good competitive games. If, if the Raiders got shut out, I'd be really sad. But I just want to see a competitive game. That's what now. Now that's what I'm getting. There's rookie of the year contenders. Anthony Edwards, Timberwolves. That's going to go to Matthew Shira. All right, final box. Good luck, everybody. It's been a pretty solid break, and the the, the game has has gotten finally gotten a little exciting here.
Yeah, that's why I have to, they have to come back a lot because their first halves are garbage. All right, now, once again, the Raiders are without a couple starting defensive backs. So that means Keenan Allen, Mike Williams can feast. That means pass rush, important. That means maybe a turnover, important. You know, like a, like a fumble recover. I, I think Herbert's pretty good with... I think Herbert doesn't throw a lot of interceptions, so maybe they're... Maybe a, a round tree lost fumble or something random like that. They could use something like that. There's Al Horford for OKC. That's to 249. No, I think Sean. I think in all seriousness, I think Sean was just was chatting because he was. It was during halftime. I'm, I'm sure he's paying attention to the game now. That that's where we need that fumble. There's Obi Top, and I need to see more hands on that football. Test that ball security. There's Obi Toppin for Shane and the Knicks. James Weissman, lottery ticket. That goes to Sean M. and the Warriors. Fleet Flicker? Inter oh. <laughs> There's no one there. I thought there was going to be a defensive back showing up there. Ooh, what a break. Anthony Edwards, rookie ticket, optic design, on-card autograph, Matthew Shira and the Timberwolves. What a break. It's a good play. We got Kevin Durant, superstar die cut. Ooh, BD saying Edwards had a nasty dunk tonight. That's good. I like it. Yeah, he's 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 got he's got some highlights in him. There's Trez to 149. Carry in the Lakers. Got Bradley Beal, season ticket in that contender's optic format. That's for Jeffrey and the Wizards. Isaac Okoro. And our last autograph is going to be Andre Pokosevsky. I just, I'm, just use that last top loader. That's for OKC. That's for you, Andrew. Let me find a top loader here for that. I know, right? Oliver, did Sean, Sean Jaspi uh, tempt fate by mentioning if Easton Stick would get into the game? I hope so. The clock on the third quarter. Last time Fourth quarter, exciting. All right, and here is an exciting recap, ladies and gentlemen, here in Pick Your Team 17. I appreciate everybody picking their teams and knocking this out on jaspiescasebreaks.com. I appreciate it. So thanks for digging deep and putting in the work. Second half of the case is in the store. That was a nice Patrick Williams. Make sure to buy at least 
two teams to be eligible for the Hornets. Maybe a Lamella will pop on the other side. Unfortunately, none on this side for you, uh, James, but hey, maybe in the other side. It's possible. This, is, this has the makings of a, a really great case. So thanks, everybody, for getting in the, on the action. We had the LeBron James, licensed to dominate, the Anthony Edwards, and a Steph Curry. What a break. Thanks, everybody. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next break. Go Raiders.